Okay, we're gonna start at the beginning. What are we doing today? Well, first of all, we'd like to apologize for the late posting of this vlog. It's because we did this. We'd also like to apologise for the fact that we are a little bit half cut while we're doing this one because we're not, well, okay. we did this. We had a brilliant time in the last couple of days of touring basically Southside Wine Bars. Southside's amazing just now because it's sunny in Glasgow uh, at the moment for those of you who don't live here and everyone's out and about and Glasgow in the sunshine is the best. So today we've decided to do an experiment, you know that we love experiments. We've wanted to do this for ages and I've been nervous about it because I've actually been injured um, in this kind of endeavour before so um, nervous about it, we've heard horror stories but we're going to give it a bash. Um, what are we doing? So, we're going to try and make our own Prosecco. We're going to talk a bit about Prosecco because... Um, it's we, delicious. Yeah, we, we really... In fact, our first date wine was Prosecco. Um, we really like Prosecco. Uh, a lot of people find it delicious. It's, it's a little bit more accessible than champagne, for example. Um, in terms of price. In terms of price, but also in terms of it's a little bit sweeter. It's not quite as... Um, complex, yeasty, it, it basically goes in the bottle, it goes off, you have to drink it. Um, you can't age it in the way that you would age um, champagne. Uh, but also in that it's just made completely differently. Um, whereas we've talked about before, champagne gets its bubbles because it undergoes a second fermentation in the bottle. Basically, you add a little kind of dosage, which is some of the sugars haven't yet been fermented, you add a little bit of extra yeast, you seal it, and that creates carbonation in the bottle. And you hand turn it every day, it's a very like labour intensive kind of technique. Um, Cava's done the same way. Cava's done in the same way, and there are other wines that are done in the same way. There's nothing to say that Prosecco can't be made in that way, um, but it's generally not. A, a lot of the time what it is is basically a giant soda stream. So um, basically uh, CO2 is pumped into the wine and that creates a carbonation and it just makes this kind of refreshing wine. So we've selected this one today to use. It's a wine that was given to us by Max from Coliseum, Coliseum Wines. Wines, which is really, really cool. Um, I'm really excited to actually try this wine anyway. Prosecco is not normally made from this these kind of grapes, so we're totally off on one, but I don't think anybody cares that much. Do you know what I think is really cool? So this wine is made from, it's a blend, so it's 70% Sauvignon Blanc. The other 30% is a grape called Arneus, and do you know what Arneus means in Italian? What? Little Rascal. Ah. Or something like that. Uh, because it's quite difficult to grow, it adds a kind of floral, crisp kind of floral note to your wine. So. I don't know if we've ever had we've never a wine made from before. that grape before. I'm sweating, by the way. I'm really? Like, just this is going to refresh you. Oh. Do you want to know where it's from? Yes, I'd like to know where it's from. It's a Piedmont wine, and that grape is a Piedmont grape. So it's native to that part of Italy. So. Oh, we love native grapes. We kind of do at the moment. Prosecco used to be made from a grape called Prosecco, and then they changed it and called it Glera. Um, Prosecco is actually a small town in Italy. There's also like 15% can be like other grapes like Pinot Noir, uh, Chardonnay, it can be, I'm going to want a bigger glass than that. Really? Mm. Even though we're having the... Yeah. you okay. Oh. Oh, it's got a really interesting yeah. smell. Um, oh, it does. Doesn't it? It's a little bit... So we should mention that you can get this wine in Salinas, so if it's good, um, that's where you can get it for a lovely summer refreshment. There's a wee bit of minerality there. There's so a definite bit of minerality in it. But in a, it's a great colour. way that... Oh. Fuck, what was that? Oh, that's nice. Mm. Oh. 
Oh man. Isn't that good? That's really Why good. Why are you making Prosecco from this? Why? That is a stupid plan. This is fucking delicious. Thanks, Max. Oh. Mm. That is delicious. So, um, anyway, we started our Prosecco making earlier. We do know someone who's done this. Um, and we're just going to phone them for some advice right now. Hopefully they pick up. Phone a friend moment. Come on, Jillian. Hello? Hello? Hello, how are you doing? Hi, I'm not bad, how are you? Very well. Um, I was just wondering, we're going to make some um, homemade Prosecco this evening. Do you have any tips that, that we should maybe know? Yes. Um, do not put too much in the bottle. So like maximum of a half, but I would go with a third. Third? So it's all about patience. It's all about patience. Right. Also, leave it to settle for about 10 minutes before you take it out. It's going to take you a while. Um, what happened when you did this? Uh, you're just right over the ceiling. <laughs> oh, um, by the way, we're filming this conversation. Oh! I can't imagine. <laughs> Now we've got our Prosecco just relaxing in the soda stream. I'm really dying to take it out now though, I don't care if it's not been 10 minutes. I I do care if it's me. What if it goes all over the ceiling? Well, we'll just open it gradually. We'll put a wee plastic bag over it. We'll put a plastic bag over it to open it. Yeah, I need another wee sample of this. I wonder what it's going to taste like when it's fizzy. We are into white wines now. It smells like the garden but it also smells like the beach a little bit. I am absolutely fucking rusting today. Liz is wearing a sports bra, but she's coloured in the Nike tick. <laughs> so it's not as obvious. I think you can't see it at all. No. Okay, well, we disgorge the soda stream. Yeah, let's disgorge the soda stream. Luckily, my camera is, in fact, weatherproof, so we shouldn't have any issue if this does spurt. Is it Prosecco proof? But we don't know if it's Prosecco proof. Let's do this. Oh, oh. Okay. It's, it's really, yeah, it's foaming up quite significantly. But all right. Very fizzy. Very I think fizzy. that's got a safety mechanism on it um, to stop it from... Because I'm turning it the wrong way, guys. That's why it wasn't coming off. Oh, and we're actually okay. It's, it's totally. It's fine, Gillian. I don't know why you were worrying. It's nowhere near the ceiling. But look, it's just lovely, gorgeous, sparkling wine. God, are you excited? Uh, so, <laughs> <laughs> here we go with our own um, bubbled uh, Italian white. Okay. And just so you know, it, we're quite disappointed that it didn't explode. A little bit disappointed, that, and we hope that you're not too disappointed. I'm gonna go for it. Let's go for it. Right. Holy shit! That's really good. It tastes like prosecco. It really does. Mm. <laughs> oh my god! Mm. Extreme surprise. <laughs> I'm really fucking, I'm so delighted that we didn't waste a really nice wine, like, carbonating it. But actually, yeah. we only used a tiny little bit, but it's really good. Um, Prosecco is our... By the way, Gillian was right, if we had filled up that bottle, it, it would have been, been like... <laughs> everywhere. Yeah. What would have been like? <laughs> what do you think? What do you actually It's think? really good. I, I have to say I like the wine better still. Yeah, okay. But it's because it's a really good wine. I am fucking hammered right now, by the way. <laughs> and now I have to edit this video while this hammered. <laughs> Are you okay? Are you broken? Do you think we nailed it though? I don't think we nailed it. I think this episode is 
an absolute Sub shambles. Standard shambles. Substandard shambles. And it's not even any who do we have cheese. to blame? So if you would like to make a complaint about how drunk we are in this episode, please um, email Anthony at Marchtown because it's kind of his fault. Well.